Team Exercise 30 Eye Contact During this exercise the team will form a circle at equal distances from each other. This whole exercise will be played in silence. The trainer will select one person from the circle to start the exercise. This person will make eye contact with another person in the circle. He nods his head to the person who he made eye contact with and the person who receives the eye contact nods back to confirm he received the eye contact. The person who received the eye contact has now the turn. He now makes eye contact with another person and nods his head. The purpose is to give the eye contact to another person than who you received it from. The next person who received the eye contact confirms with a nod and proceeds to make eye contact with someone else from the circle. This phase will be played until everyone has gotten and sent eye contact a few times. The next phase will have a game element. You randomly select someone to leave the room. When the person has left the room, you select someone who will have the first turn to start the eye contact. The person who has just left the room comes back and will stand in the center of the circle. He will try to find out where the eye contact is. He does not know who has the first turn. The people from the circle will try to pass on the eye contact when the person in the center looks the other way and is unaware of where the eye contact is. The trainer will keep track of the score and counts how many times the eye contact has been passed on until the person in the center has caught the eye contact. The faster the person in the center has spotted the eye contact, the less points he receives and the better he has done. When the person in the center has spotted the eye contact, his round is over. In this case he has 6 points. He joins the circle and selects a new person to stand in the center. The person may leave the circle but can also just close his eyes for a few seconds while you select someone to start the eye contact. He opens his eyes and the same game will be played. The person in the center will as quickly as possible try to find out where the eye contact is. In this case the person in the center spotted the eye contact quite quickly and only receives 3 points. He rejoins the circle and selects someone else who has not been in the center yet. Continue like this until everyone has stood in the center and played the game. The person with the lowest number of points wins. When multiple people have the same score, for example a score of 3 points, you can do a second round with the winners until there is one final winner. The trainer guides the team, gives feedback and brings variations to the exercise. What kind of variations you can read below this video on YouTube. And please subscribe to our channel to see a new team exercise each Sunday on youtube.com slash team exercises to improve cooperation and communication.